The worst of the snowfalls may be over, but the wintry weather across northwestern Europe has left behind disruption and destruction. Miraculously, nobody was killed when more than 100 vehicles collided on a motorway in Germany. Those who escaped unscathed say the weather was a key factor. It all happened very quickly. Suddenly there was heavy snowfall coming sideways. That was the reason why visibility was very limited. You couldn't see anything in front. And when I hit the brakes, there was no immediate response. The accident happened north of Frankfurt. This was the scene at the city's airport when the worst of the weather hit. For a time, the airport was forced to close completely due to the snow. Hundreds of flights were cancelled. It was a similar picture at Charles de Gaulle Airport in Paris. Delays and cancellations. Departure boards making for depressing reading. Travel by rail was also disrupted. Eurostar high-speed train services were suspended. Passengers in Brussels found themselves stranded. I'm supposed to be going on the Eurostar today to get back to London um, to see my daughter who's just given birth to twins. But unfortunately, um, my train was delayed for a long time. And so now the Eurostar has also been cancelled. Uh, so now I am stuck. At St Pancras Station in London, the misery continued for Eurostar passengers. But some travellers found ways to lift the mood. Eurostar says it expects to operate an amended timetable on Wednesday. As in France, Germany and Belgium, this late blast of winter left much of southern Britain under a blanket of snow. Unseasonably cold temperatures mean a widespread thaw could take some time. And on the Channel Islands, experiencing some of the worst conditions in decades, all thoughts of spring have been buried. James Kelly, BBC News.